Hi, I'm Avalon and we're here with another introduction session to our Link Engine Management ECU range. Today we're going to describe the difference between the two types of ECU Link has on offer, a plug-in ECU and a wiring ECU. <laughs> First up is the plug-in. This is a direct replacement for the factory unit in your car, and no additional wiring is required when installing a plug-in. As the name suggests, you simply unplug the old ECU and plug the new one in. Our G4 Plus plug-in ECUs give you more ability to tune your car and also cater for aftermarket parts such as a turbo, which are generally not supported by the factory ECU. We have a large range of plug-ins for models including Nissan, Toyota, Mitsubishi, and more. If, however, your car is undergoing an engine swap or going to be used for race purposes, a wire and ECU is probably the better solution. Once again, we have a wide variety of wire-ins on offer, depending on which engine you are utilising and what features it requires. Wire-ins do require a full rewire of the vehicle concerned. However, the extra hard work is rewarded with complete control and almost infinite adjustability of the engine. Wire and ECUs are designed to be tuned and modified, so they handle many different kinds of parameters. Even our base level ECUs, such as the Monsoon here, cater for flex fuel, engine protection limiters, and data logging. If it's more advanced features you are after, such as e throttle, traction control, or peak and hold injection, you'd be looking at one of our upper level ECUs, such as the Thunder we have here. To make your ECU choice, you need to consider which of these special features you are after and also take into consideration your budget. To help make this choice easier for you, we have a comparison chart available on our website at www.linkecu.com. We wish you all the very best in selecting the right ECU to get the most out of your engine.